Hey guys, we are back at it like a perfume addict, and this time it's a Libra season. So if you wanna see scents for your zodiac sign, make sure you stay tuned for this video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. What's up my YouTubers and YouTubies? It's your girl Rain Purple Wine, AKA Snugglepuss, and we're coming back at it with Libra season, okay? so. Libra season runs from September 23rd to October 23rd, and we're just going to jump right in. Remember, I'll be taking some information from the Complete Book of Astrology, which is by Caitlin, um, Caitlin Johnstone. So, what I know about a Libra, I'll tell you from my personal experience. Um, if I don't know nothing else about a Libra, I know Libras are super charming, okay? Okay charming with a capital c honey they will charm your pants right off honey uh, you know they they are charming so that's what i know from my personal experience i also know that they're very balanced people and they also have a depth to them you know you like you really have to get to know a libra to know you know those very deep thoughts they're very deep thinkers okay so let's go over some positive attributes um, they're very intellectual, independent, respectful, artistic, observant, and compromising. Okay. Okay. So what we're going to be focusing on today, of course, is the essential oils and the aromatherapy for Libra, the Libra sign. So you guys have cam chamomile, daffodil, dill, eucalyptus, fennel, geranium, peppermint, pine, spearmint, Palmarosa and vanilla. So you guys are totally lucky that you have vanilla because vanilla is really readily available in most of the base notes of perfume. So I'm going to give you four that I <clears throat> that I like for um, that have the base with vanilla. I I couldn't really find very many perfumes with chamomile or daffodil. I don't think I have any with daffodil. I may have a perfume that has geranium somewhere, but I'm not exactly sure of where it is, okay, or which one it is. So I'm giving you the ones that have the vanilla in the <clears throat> in the base. So first I have Midnight Fantasy by Britney Spears. This is like a blueberry bomb, but it's very sweet. And it's one where you can definitely smell the sweetness of the blueberry and the vanilla. So that's Britney Spears' fantasy. All the perfumes that I'm going to be showing you are Ete Parfums. They're EDPs. Okay, this is Kat Von D's Saint. This is the 2009 version, not to be confused with the 2017 reformulated version, which I still haven't tried. But I love this scent it's very creamy it's very uh very sweet and sensual and you can definitely smell the creaminess of the vanilla and the sandalwood in this scent this is saint 2009 um by kat von d okay we also have guess seductive this is more on the floral side yeah it's definitely more on the floral side but it also has the vanilla in the base and it, it this i like this one because it, it lasts a pretty good while um and it's and it's it's user friendly I, I feel like you can't really go wrong with guest seductive you know it's a very likable scent i think by most people um okay last but not least i have dolce and cabana pour femme this is a very sweet marshmallowy uh fragrance that has vanilla in the base as the base note and I really enjoy, I enjoy this one quite a bit. The longevity is great. The projection is great. Um, <clears throat> so this is one to check out. Like I said, it also reminds me of the original Britney Spears fantasy. But it's still, there's still very good scents. Okay, so that's Dolce & Gabbana. The, I'm sorry, Dolce & Gabbana Pour Femme. All right, so remember, we're also going to have two recommendations by Total Beauty. And Total Beauty pretty much feels that Libras are nice to everyone. I don't know if that is particularly true, but that's what Total Beauty feels about your sun sign, that you're nice to everyone. So they're going to give you two perfumes. So make sure you guys stay tuned for those two perfumes um, that Total, Total Beauty recommends. And also, I'm going to be showing you four celebrities that also have your Libra that share your Libra sun sign. 
Okay, so that's, oh wait, one more thing before I go. Another way that you guys can incorporate your, <laughs> incorporate your essential oils is by burning a candle. Find candles that have your essential oils in it. Um, <clears throat> you can usually find peppermint or chamomile candles, um, but definitely they always have a good old vanilla candle, you know, around in most places. So definitely check out just burning the candle if you want to get your essential oils in that way and you don't want to necessarily wear them on your skin. Okay, so FYI, guys, I am going to be doing each zodiac sign each zodiac sign will have a video but some of them may overlap just like i'm putting out the libra um video and it's actually virgo season so guys don't feel bad each sign will have their own individual video but some of them will overlap into each other's seasons so no big deal guys but everybody is going to have their own uh for their season so Shout out to all the Libras. Happy early birthday. You guys are coming in on the 23rd of September. So I hope you guys turn up and have a great time. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, guys. Don't forget to, don't forget to hit that sub, can I speak? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and make sure you turn on your post notifications so that you're uh, notified every single time I upload, okay? It has been a pleasure to do Libras um, today. And we have Scorpios up next. So I'll see you guys for that. Stay tuned for my next video. I love all my addicts. And you guys have a great day. Bye. So Total Beauty Fills, you guys, are romantic. So you need the rose. This is Diptyque's Ooh Rose. And this is Chloe's Love Story. We have T.S. Eliot. He's a poet. September 26th. Jesse Jackson, October 8th. Sigourney Weaver, October 8th as well. And Will Smith, September 25th. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next one.